The following demonstration will show New South Wales Commercial Abalone Fishers how to submit a linked abalone postland fishing activity report using Fisher Mobile. This demonstration assumes that you have already submitted an abalone pre-fish report for your business as required by the fishing activity reporting rules for your fishery. To lodge a postland report for your previously submitted pre-fish report, tap on the activity report icon on the home screen to access the fishing activity reporting menus. If only one fishing business and the fishing activity options are automatically displayed for selection. Otherwise from the bar on the left hand side locate and tap on your abalone fishing business number to select it. The activity reports relevant to your abalone fishing business will be displayed. Move down the screen and locate the Postland Report tile. An option to create a Postland Report from the pre-fish report you submitted earlier should be available. If you have more than one of these options in this tile, you will need to select the one you now need to complete from the information displayed. Tap on Create to create the linked Postland Report. The Quota Species Court screen is displayed showing the fishing business number with the date and time of the submitted pre-fish report. Abalone will display ticked. Notice that it has been greyed out so that you cannot unselect or remove it. Note there is a No Species Court button. The use of this button does not apply to abalone fishes. Please disregard the No Species Court button. Now tap on the forward arrow to proceed. Tap into the Abalone Quota Usage Kilo field and enter the accurate total validated weight of abalone in kilos to one decimal place. In this example, 85.1 kilos. When data is entered against a quota species, the species name banner will show an edited sign. This provides the fisher with a visual way of tracking that weight has been entered. Once the validated weight has been entered, tap on the forward arrow to proceed. Next, the landing location needs to be entered. Tap on the location type field and select from either the landing location or lat long degree minute options. Both of these options will be demonstrated. Select landing location and this will display the location code field. If known, the landing location code can be entered directly into this field. If the location code is not known, you can search for the location by entering the location name. In this example, Eden has been entered and the code selected from the available list. Or to enter the location type in the latitude and longitude format, select the lat long degree minute option. The coordinates of your landing location can be entered directly into the displayed fields if known. If you are at your landing location and your mobile device has GPS location services enabled, you can tap on the current location button to auto-populate your latitude and longitude fields. If you are not in the location where you landed, do not use this feature. For this example, the landing location will be used. To complete the report, tap on the forward arrow. A confirmation message will be displayed. Read this message and note confirming that this postland report will deduct the quota amount in kilos and the available abalone quota balance is also displayed prior to the deduction. Then tap on the confirm button. A receipt message is displayed stating that your postland report has deducted the quota amount in kilos and a transaction ID reference number. Your new available abalone quota balance is also displayed. Tap on the OK button to return to the home screen. If you return to the Fishing Activity Reports screen for the fishing business, you will now notice that the Postland Report tile has updated to show that you no longer have a pending pre-fish report awaiting Postland Report completion. If you submitted the Postland Report on the same day that you submitted the corresponding pre-fish report, you will also note that your pre-fish report in the Active Report tile has been removed. To return to the Home screen, tap on the Home icon. You have just viewed a demonstration on how to submit a linked abalone Postland Report using Fisher Mobile. For more video demonstrations on the functions and use of Fisher Mobile, visit the Fish Online website.